Kopecki on swings. It's a high drive to left center field. At the wall. It is gone. A grand slam for Acuna. Freddie Freeman. That ball is gone. And the Braves are back in front. And there will be a game four tomorrow. All right. The Braves stayed alive with a big win last night over the Dodgers today. It's game four from Atlanta. Coverage starts at 4 Eastern right here on FS1 and the Fox Sports app. I'm going to watch that one, but let's get back to the NFL. Yesterday, the Browns beat the Ravens in overtime. Baker Mayfield threw for 342 yards, had a key 39-yard pass on third down that helped set up the game-winning field goal. It was his first win as a starter, and Cleveland is now 2-2-1 and one behind the Ravens and Bengals in their division. Mm. Skip. Yes. Can Cleveland Boy, be a threat? I know, I'm Jeez, liking this. so nice to me. It's Monday. Incredible. Watch tomorrow, Jenny. Which, how you, in the AFC North. Can they how your threat? graciousness get repaid. Watch tomorrow. Really? Hey, Shannon, okay. just wait. Just wait. Spoiler alert. <laughs> I think at least the Browns can be the spoiler in this division. And if Hugh Jackson had done what I campaigned though before through training camp and started Baker from the start, they would be 5-0. and oh. it, That's considering that they did get robbed in Oakland. And I think you agree. They got robbed in overtime in Oakland. Yeah. All right? Yeah, what about that okay. field goal kicker in New Orleans? Well, I don't know. If Baker had been there, it wouldn't even been close. Skip, you know what you need to stop. The guy missed two field goals and two PATs. Mm -hmm. Really, Skip? So, they are 2-2-1, two, two and one, these Cleveland Browns, mm -hmm. these Baker Browns. Boomer Baker, that's what I, like I said, that. right? You yeah. like that? Baker. So, here's what happens. Your Super Bowl pick is coming to Cleveland, the L.A. Chargers, and they've sort of righted the ship at 3-2. and two. You yep. still on that bandwagon? You still good with them? Maybe. Maybe not. I, I kind of like Cleveland's chances in this game. And then Cleveland goes to Tampa. My, I think they could win that game. Then they go to Pittsburgh. They play the heck out of Pittsburgh. They, they did even last year. So could, could they steal a game at Pittsburgh? Probably not. It looked like Pittsburgh was finally back in business yesterday. Poised for takeoff. Then Kansas City comes to Cleveland. That'll be a marquee shootout between mm -hmm. Baker and Mahomes, won't it? Mm -hmm. uh, I'll be watching that game. Can they win that game? Probably not. Atlanta at home, they could probably win that. At Cincinnati, probably not. But then this, this closing stretch at Houston, Carolina, at Denver, Cincinnati at home, they could get on a roll in that stretch. They, Man, they might win game. one game. game. No, nope, no, nope. they could win a bunch of games there, and then they close at Baltimore, and they play Baltimore tough. I think you're going to find they play everybody tough in this division, especially with Baker Mayfield at quarterback. I love the way the defense played yesterday. I think they will at least, they will dictate the outcome of this division because they're going to score some big upsets starting yesterday, obviously, with Baltimore. So you say they're 2-2-1. Two, two, and one. What mm -hmm. do you think their final record will be? Mm. I think that, you know, I said before the game, I, uh, before the year started, if he would start Baker, they would win nine games. That's what I said. And if right. they were 5-0 and oh right now, you'd be in trouble with that one. Right. So I'll adjust to seven. I think they can win seven games. Uh, can they win the division? Are they a threat? Mm. I put it to you like this, Skip Bayless. If everybody plays their best, Cleveland is not the best team in this division. They're not. They're the fourth team in this division. Pittsburgh played their best. Baltimore, Cincinnati, they can't beat any of those teams. Mm. They catch these teams on an off day. Now, I don't think as they as the season goes along, mm -hmm. I think they have caught some teams by surprise. Teams mm -hmm. not realizing how good they are, especially defensively. And now that they have Baker in the inserted into the offense. Mm -hmm. They don't realize how good. They're better than people give them credit for because they can run the football. They play action off that. Baker's making some big-time throws. Mm -hmm. Those receivers are stepping up, making plays for Baker. Uh, I had them winning five games. Maybe I adjust that to six. Ooh. Um, but that last, those last four games, I don't see you get see them mm -hmm. getting on a roll. Mm -hmm. I think it's going to get really tough for them. So, I'll, you know, um, they've improved a lot. They're a, a much better football team than they were last year. They upgraded the talent, mainly at the quarterback position. That's where it starts. That's the foundation piece you must have in order to be successful in this league. I still don't trust Baltimore. I don't trust Pittsburgh's defense. Okay. Joe Flacco, one week he throws right, 385 and just makes Ben Roethlisberger look like mm -hmm. a, a rookie quarterback. And then the next week, he he doesn't know what's going on. And what have you always said about Andy Dalton? When you least expect it, he turns back into Andy Dalton. The first half Correct? of that ball game, I'm like, Andy Dalton, what are you doing? Yeah. Have you ever played quarterback before? <laughs> have you ever played an NFL game before? The one yesterday. Yes, yesterday against the Dolphins. Against the Dolphins. Oh. 17 up. And the next thing you know, he can't miss a throw. Can't miss a throw.
Hmm. So I believe, Skip, if everybody plays their best, Cleveland doesn't stand a chance. But we know everybody's not going to play their best on every given Sunday. Hmm. 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 I don't think they're going to call the Steelers or the Ravens to stay up or the Bengals to stay up late at hmm. night saying we're worried about Cleveland. Hmm. If I think the Ravens stayed up late last night worried about Cleveland. Well, they stayed up late last night because Joe Flacco could have made this thing a 10-0 mm -hmm. ball game. 10-0 yep. is a big difference than 3 nothing. <sighs> what do I call him? Joe Fluco. Stop saying oh, it. Well, yes. Did he not turn back into Fluco? Yeah, he, 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 he did. Yeah. But I'm trying to figure out, I'm looking at these stats, I'm like, okay, you're getting 4.6 yards a clip. Why do you need Joe Flacco to throw the ball 58 times? Hmm. Uh, did, did, I, did, I, did I miss uh, wait, 56? Mm -hmm. 57 total because uh, Lamar Jackson threw a pass. Mm -hmm. They need to stop that, too. Mm -hmm. Skip, they, they, how, how does doing this, what they're doing with Lamar it's Jackson, how does, that, how does that help him get better at the quarterback position? It's just wrong. It's, yeah. it's beneath his dignity to have to be subjected to those plays. I mean, you come in, but whatever. Yep. I mean, you, I'm looking at this, I'm like, Collins got 4.9, and Allen has eight, uh, 4.3. Flacco, even Flacco had 6.5. 25 carries, a buck 16, 4.6, and you let Joe Flacco throw the ball 56 times? Mm. 56? You're not winning a whole lot of games mm. with Joe Flacco throwing the ball that many okay. times. Yeah. So you don't trust the Pittsburgh defense, you don't trust Fluco, and you don't trust Andy Dalton, yet you're saying Cleveland's the worst team in the division. Because really? they got a rookie quarterback. Okay. Do you trust the rookie quarterback going forward? I do. Do you trust the Cleveland defense going forward? I, I think I do, except for that debacle in Oakland. But see, you you under the assumption that Baker Mayfield is going to play like he played Sunday mm. for the rest of the season, mm. and you and I know rookie quarterbacks don't do that. No. Mm. Well, Dak did. Well, he did. He did. He was lights out the whole year. He led the the, the yeah. league in QBR to the last game. Okay, it's impossibly. Great. I know you wish that Dak would rear his head again, mm. Mm. but I don't see it, Skip. Huh. He was fourth in QBR last year. What is he right now? Not very. Good. Last year doesn't have anything to do with now. We just talked about Philly. Stop you know worrying about last year. If, if you suited up for Dallas right now, you would be his best target Dude. at age 50. Seriously. <laughs> no, I'm serious. You would be his best target. I'm not doing anything to help the Cowboys. I want to suit you, up you'd somebody You'd be better else. than Jeff Swaim or Blake Jarwin. That's oh, it. Bridge your boy, Rico caught you, one last night. Rico night. caught one, and I thought, and, and they threw the Hail Mary to Rico in the end zone, and he got lost at the end of the of regulation. It was DeAndre really Hopkins batted at he that. He did. He did. And Rico was kind of like looking Stop. up in the lights. You, see, you know what? You wanted him to throw it because I met you. If here. Rico had come down with that ball, this show would have been not, over today. No, 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 you no. wouldn't have even shown Are up. You're exactly right. I would have called in sick. Woo. I would have called in sick. Please there's don't no do that. way. There's no way I'm coming in. Mm -hmm. Dak throws a Hail Mary and Rico <laughs> gets a catch. I'm not doing it. You won't it, be dude. here? Nope. Okay. Nope. It would have been over. Nope. 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 <laughs> you know what? I'm talking myself into these Browns now. I, I think they. You're talking yourself into what? One, two. Maybe three, four, five, six, seven, plus two. They could, they could still win nine games. They're not oh. winning nine games. Can nine I get some do on that? No, nope, not yet. Not yet? I need to see it one more time against I'm, these Chargers. All I know is I'm This is your 10. Super Bowl team with the, the season on the line at three and two going to Hey, Hey, guy, this. All I know is that I'm under 10. I'm no longer in double digits when it comes to do. Wait, I thought it was 10. No, no. It went back to 11. No, 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 no. You lost one last week. No, 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 I didn't. Well, you did. You lost to me against Detroit. I had them against Detroit. I had them against Detroit. Oh. Yeah, I had them. So now we nine. There was some other game. And I'm finna get, I might get another one this week if we bet Jacksonville. Okay, we'll see about that. I get Jacksonville. Yeah, I think you were talking yourself out of Jacksonville. I was out. You don't want a better case of do on Blake Boy. I sure don't. Because I already know what he going to do. Hmm. Okay. Want to go I, now? I'll go now. Mm -mm. I got to see. I got to see how it goes. Maybe to make a quarterback change in Jacksonville. <laughs> really? Like, what are we waiting on? Okay. <laughs> we about to make a change, Skip Bayless. Hmm. Told you what was going to happen. You come around on Baker Mayfield. I think you're starting to I know, believe. Yeah. We've I, been trying. Believe. I'll give him. Cre I'll give credit where due. Yep. He played well yesterday, but tomorrow is a new day. Credit where it's due. D E W. Right. Gonna get me another mm -hmm. case yeah. out of you. Mm -hmm. By the time the season will win, I'll be in the front. With the do. Probably be a You will not. You're down nine. K I think you're down ten, but nine. I'll give you nine. But uh, uh, week by week. We still got what? We still got 11 weeks to go, Skip. Mm -hmm. Just chipping 12 away. 12 weeks. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. Chip it away. That do back. I got Baker. And if I, get, <laughs> and if I get me a little Oklahoma bed here and there, ain't no telling. Because mm. oh. you see Tua. Mm. Ooh, Skip.
At some point in time, they got to go ahead and call the man Trophy because it takes a long name to spell his name. Mm. You yeah. know that Tua Tagovailoa? Mm. That's not his real. I mean, Tua, you know, that's not his first name. Tyler oh, actually oh. played better than Tua. No, he didn't. He didn't have any defense. Oh, Don't do, Skip, why would you? Skip, <laughs> the man has seven fewer touchdowns than incomplete. He's playing Arkansas. I had to play Texas. Ginny, is there Texas any good? Texas yeah, is pretty Texas good, good on defense. They're on to something. Really? Yeah. Really? You, you missed the electric comeback. How many? Did you watch on what? Saturday? Yeah, I watched it. Kyler Murray threw okay, four touchdown passes and ran for one that was if you don't mind, It if was you, his Heisman it moment was, run. That right? was pretty special. If you don't mind me asking, how did they get behind? What did he do, Jenny? Uh, a couple turnovers. Oh, are we, are we, so are we just going to just brush that to the side? My guy hadn't turned it over. See, my guy gets in a shootout, and he has to try to do a little more than he's capable of doing even at his Heisman level. <sighs> Tua got it in the bag. As yeah. much as I love this college football chat, I think we're going to wrap it up for now. But we'll get to it later. And something is wrong with the Eagles. What is it? What, Michael what Vick it? answers that it's not question the quarterback. next. Ah, uh, that's debatable. It's not the quarterback. And I won't back down. First Man is the best movie of the year. Your dad's going to land on the moon. You need to fail down here. So we don't fail up there. We got a bad fire! They're gone, Leo. What are the chances this is the last time the boys are going to see you? Do you think you're coming back? We have serious problems. 